What is up all you beautiful people? It is I, Akemi TCG, back here at the brand new video. Last collection video, we got $2,000 worth of stuff. And this collection, we have $1,600 worth of stuff. So this is more like quantity. It's from a, uh, a buddy of mine in the comment section. So we're gonna open it up, crack a lacking one at a time. We'll see what's in these uh, boxes, $1,600. I just caught myself, Jesus Christ. All right. Not like it hurt. But we're good. We're good. Obviously, open them backwards so it leak my address. Bam. Let's go. Let's come closer. Let's do this. Ooh, I see. Whoa, some pages here. That's correct. Let's look it up. There's some pages here. So there's a whole bunch of boxes there. Wow. Okay. Cool. Cool. So I'm pretty sure these are the gravity controllers. Good. Okay, so these are singular pages. I'm gonna go right through them. Got Utopic Zexo there, Format Skipper. Got some non Yu Gi Oh cards. This looks like, oh, is this custom? Is that Todoroki? Yeah, it's that good. It's Midoriya. Hey, didn't know there'd be My Hero cards in here too. Chaos Forms, Game of Drives. I'm wondering if these are all different stuff. Okay, so it seems like they're all the same stuff. Well, if you're playing the Pride of Planet Rikas, Got those, Rip Jet Synchron, a Salmon Great Package. Yep, that's rip this card. This card's broken. Got a Hita, a whole Salmon Great Package. All the, the Spellbook Package. Pretty much, you just play the Secrets of Knowledge. If you're playing Dark Magician, you should play 111. Ooh, the Diablos Package, the Darkest Diablos Package, the Lair Package. No, recently a lot of the stuff got reprinted, but I think the Structure Deck is still worth a little bit of money. Mega Little Smasher. Uh, Hop Ear Squadrons. You're playing, I don't know what deck you'd be playing that in, but. Melfies. Yeah, I don't think you only play one though, right? One or two? Mm, maybe three sometimes. Arborias. Yeah, Blue Eyes, White Dragon, Dark Magician. Oh, what's the Tormentor? Is this a secret one? Oh, that's from the 10. That's from the 10. I haven't seen these in a while, so. That's pretty neat. Is there multiples? Wait. Yeah. Oh, oh shoot. <laughs> oh, shoot. Guys, I missed Oh, there's some Infinite Track stuff. Oh, I missed those. I was wondering why you weren't flipping them over. I didn't see. Oh. Because I, I'm, I'm, I'm looking the other way, you know what I mean? Generator package. Ooh. <laughs> we got Lobster. We got Secret Condemned Witches for the generator package. Three boss stages here. Wait, where's the model at, though? It was right there on the bottom. Oh, nice, nice, nice. You only need to play the one. A. Speed fly, the pages. Oh, uh, battle wasp. Oh, the battle wasp stuff. More insect stuff. Is that OG shrink? Oh no, it's not. It's not. Danger, Mothman, Miss Valley Soldier, New Space Connector, uh, Lyric Classic. What's that? Morphine jar. What set is that from? Wow. Okay, that's kind of new. Jackalope, Ghost Spell. Ib. I like I like love the the uh, artwork on that card. It looks so clean. Junk speeder. This is sad. Let's see what's in these boxes. I mean, let's see. There's a soft mat here, so let's look at it. Oh, look at this! It's such a simple mat. It's a two-player mat. The purple. Mm -hmm. Nice, cool. I'm gonna use it right here. I'm gonna leave it right here. Cool. Big fan of the cloth. Oh, there's four giant deck boxes. So let's see what's in this one. If you guys are liking the video, make sure to drop a like, comment, and subscribe. That'll help me greatly. Thank you. Ready? One, two, three. Bam! Ooh, looks like a... It's a bougie it's a deck. deck box. Dividers. dividers. Oh, these are all Magic the Gathering dividers. Sick. So there could be multiple decks in here, but they're all the same sleeves. I'm curious about what it's in. Oh, so this is the Ancient Warriors deck. So it's all the Ancient Warriors cards, and he has a lot of spares here. So I'm pretty sure the stuff that he leaves on the outside is the spares, and the stuff in the sleeve is actually the part of the deck core. So if you're playing Ancient Warriors, I got you guys. I got you. Whole Ancient Warrior package, and I think you play three of these, and then two of those, one of that. Ooh, Fire Force Tankies. Yeah, Fire Formation Tankies. And then we got Double Dragon Lords, really good in uh, pretty much any wind deck. So that's pretty cool. A little bit of Ancient Warrior core deck here. And let's see what else is in here. Oh shoot. 
feel like I just damaged like five cards. No! Marinsus. Is it Evil Eyes? Mm hmm. So Evil Eye. OG Serzios. Uh, OG Pandemoniums. These are all OG stuff, so it looks really nice compared to the tin ones. Ooh, the OG. Cool. I'm assuming this is the rest of the Marinsus stuff, so let's go right through it. We've got Frogos. Oh no. Uh, I'm smelling a toad. Paleozoic, Olenoids, Dynamiscus, Current, Ho, 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 Ho. Coral Net, oh, these are OGs too. Ooh, Beautiful. Marble Rock, Secrets, OG, OG. I think this is the rest of it. And then. Witchcrafters. Witchcrafters, so these are. End of the Marinsa stuff, so Piscalis. Obviously, you play the three Piscalis, and then I don't think you play any of those at all, ever. Which, oh, OG Madame Berries. Beautiful. The secret. Extra Hanes, Skemetas. Oh, it's like almost, it's like Max, except for OG Skemetas. Secret uh, Creations. Yeah, that's nice. I like it. Cool. Digging all these rogue decks. It's actually pretty neat. Shout out to this guy. He kept it extremely organized. I'm actually extremely impressed because most people uh, don't really keep their cards organized. <laughs> that's just how it is. Oh. Alright, so that's the first box. The two more boxes. I'm actually kind of curious what's in store. Oh, is this another. Oh, it's a mat bag. It's a bag for your mats. There's another mat there, so I kind of want to see what it is. Hopefully it's not too lewd for this channel. Oh shoot. Oh look! It's Magdalene. It's a Magdalene. That looks sick. I like it. And Bapple. Yeah, Bapples. Rip that card. Alright, in the yellow deck box. Ooh, there's definitely more decks here. A lot of loose cards, so I want to look through these. See if there's anything cool here. Krakos. OG Max. Gotems. Oh, uh, got him. Fun fact, this is one of the this is one of the very few synchros where you can use as many tuners as possible to make the card because it doesn't say non-tuner it says one tuner plus one or more earth monsters so as long as they're earth monsters you can use even tuners it's pretty neat right OG crystal wing Ultimaya, Soken, Shenshen, the virtual world stuff oh no I think that's some of the virtual world stuff here yep got all the virtual world package Got the Lao Laos, the Kirins, the Lulus. It's all three. It's pretty much the whole virtual world deck. There we go. I don't. Okay. Oh, wait, this is the level three package. But there's Psychic Wielder, OG from Savage Strike 2. Which is nice. The OG cards are just so nice. Alright, let's grab this here. I'm excited. I don't know. I actually don't remember what's in the second box. So let's see. We got some secret cosmics, secret twins, uh, dual saga pots, machine dupes, OG, OG foolish burial goods, all buys, <laughs> signet minings, dark rulers, OG, seed imports, OG, instant fusions, these are ultras. Oh, so this must be all like staples. Where art thou? Exchange. What happened to this card? Jesus. <laughs> Do you see this? Exchange. From Duelist Pack Yugi. Book of Moon. Book of Moon. One for Ones. Terraformings. Cosmic. So, uh, I swear. So, there should be more staples here. Oh, God. Ooh. Oh, no. Alta, guys. Faker, Faker. Siliquis Protocol. Yep, that's, that's the whole core. You play this and play a hundred... Either a ton of regular traps or a ton of hand traps, and that's how you make the deck. Hextia. Oh, I don't think they play that card. They don't. Alright, Reborns. Ooh, Secret Scapegoats. Beautiful. Regekis. OG. Ooh. Ooh. SOD. SDD. Oh, is that Secret Desires? Wow, yeah. I haven't seen those in a while. You don't need to see these, right? No. Secret Desires. 
Ooh. OG extravagances. Super polys. Super super polys. Uh, secret super poly. O see, not OG, but secret polymerization in the cosmics were in the other pile. So cool. We'll mm -hmm. get that cool rarity bumps for our decks. It's pretty neat. And then, ho ho ho. There's another side to this. So it's either the traps or it's a different deck, but that's a lot of like black sleeves. So it has to be an extra deck. For the plants, starving venom. Oh, these are all the super poly targets. This is a European print. Look how dark it is. Mm. Ooh, secret thousand eyes. A rare fish, good card. I'm actually not kidding about it. <laughs> Matisse. Ooh, wow, that's beautiful. Ultimate Horus. I'll put the ultimates out to the side here. Degusta Emerald Seeker Original. Exiton Original. Totally Toad. awesome. He's so totally awesome. If this card goes to three, it's gonna go up a little bit more. Ooh! Nightmare Phoenix. It's getting reprinted again. As a and collector's every, rare. As a rare and a collector's rare. Oh. Averti Anacondas. Uh, needle fiber. BLS. It's a good hit. Just put these inside here. I know the desires are worth much, but I'll go back into it after. Apples. Apples. IPs. It's an OG OG. OG OG. Oh, access code. There we go. <laughs> Boros Sword OG. Cloth Sheep. Cl cloth Deep. No. That's how you actually. It was actually called. It's called Clothy before um, we got OG Phantasmus. Drawing Rose. Ash. Valor. Oh, this is all like Hand Trap City. Nibirus. Nibiru. Uh, Bavagon. OG Sphere Modes. Oh, he has a ton of them. These are uh, Bakugans. What do we call them? It's just signed. <laughs> uh, someone. Dinko Snickers. Anchor Tops. That card's busted. Ice Dragon's Prison. Your favorite card. Infinite Impermanences. OG evenly matches. Secret. Cool, I don't have those yet, so we're swapping them. Summon Limits. There can be only none. Uh, Cheeto Fingers. Uh, OG Dimensional Barriers. They used to be, uh, when I played in college, Dimensional Barrier used to be like a $60, $70 card, so. And this is before Master Rule 4, that's why. Imperial Order, Red Reboot. There's no card that's strong, it just shuts off your opponent's deck. You're like, okay, this shuts it off. Gee, red reboot, so. How do you feel about this collection so far, Ashley? I good? like them. You like it? There's so many secrets. There's so many nice ones? Yeah. You dig in the, what's your favorite <laughs> one so far? Is it the, the Boral Sword? Is it the BLS? The yeah, Avermax, the BLS? Uh-huh. You don't like BLS. The thing is, like, it's expensive, but I haven't had that played against me in, like, three Probably a year. I haven't mm -hmm. seen somebody play in a year. Because it was really good against Sky Striker. Mm -hmm. But afterwards, it's just. No, oh, we have two more boxes. Jeez. <laughs> Plunders! Ooh. Wait, wait, what happened? I thought we were in plunder territory. <laughs> you went right in the middle. I know. It's kind of <laughs> hard because, like, it's actually really hard to get the cards out of here. Oh, so this is the ABC deck. Because you got infinity and everything there, and you got the all this good stuff. Oh, Galaxy Soldiers! There we go. Union Drivers, C Crush, B, A, Silver, Gold, Gold, yeah, <laughs> Gold, Cockadoodle Do. Card's actually pretty good. The Sol Solar Wind Jammer or Sonic Wind Jammer. Uh. I see a salvage. Oh yeah, that's a blunders for sure. Uh that's muskets. That's muskets. <laughs> okay. The plunders. Woohoo! We got white beard, red beard, uh, every beard, your beard, my beard. I can't grow a beard. Salvage. Patrol booty. And then here is the muskets. Yay, muskets! Magical muskets. Oh, these must be the OG. Oh, this is kaiju muskets? That's actually a smart way to play the deck. Because it's like, I don't care what you have, I'm just gonna get rid of it with the kaiju. Don't you love kaijus? No. Well, I'll just play them. It's like, oh, you have a monster? I know. Kaiju. 
Yeah, Kaiju <laughs> Musket Vanity's Fiend. Oh, this is scary. Coral Wait. Green. Oh, OG Cyber Dragons. Oh, they're so Well, good. I haven't seen those in forever, but these are the side. This spot one. Violon Cube. This card is busted. I hate this card. Leg like Spreader. Lancia. The card is busted. Tolkien Collectors. That's my favorite one, Starfire. Starfire. Raven. Uh, yeah. I like Starfire's art. Starfire's really cool. Yeah. That's all musket deck. So we got the musket deck, we got the plunder patrols, and then we got. What's in here? Wait, is this a shark deck? Is this a shark deck? I see Vespento. Oh! Aqua Actress. Aqua Actresses. Sick. <laughs> this fish looks so funny. It's Princess Tuna. No wait. Life, lifeless Leaf Fish is like one of the funniest cards. Fury Kairu Shin. Oh, I smell something. Ooh, number 37. Lancia Shark. It's like Lancia before Lancia. Crystal Zero Lancer. And Vespento. Oh, you have to play Vespento on that. I don't know too much about the deck, but it's... It's quite tricky to play from what I've heard. The sharks? Yeah, tricky to play as in like against hand traps. It, well, the reason why a lot of rogue decks are rogue mm -hmm. is because simply because they just have a hard time against hand traps. That's really it. I feel like everyone has a hard time. I guess. No, meta doesn't have a hard time against hand traps. Really? Mm. Tell any Dragon Link player they can play through like seven hand traps, except for Nibiru. They can't play through Nibiru. <laughs> no, this is not. The reason why. Uh, some decks are meta, some decks are not. Is meta just can play so many hand traps and they can one card combo like anything. Hmm. But against rogue, like sometimes, like uh, like let's say prank heads, right? One ash, the prank head turns over. That's it, it's over. Hmm. That's how it be. But Rika's one ash, my turn's usually over. Speaking of Rika's, Evil Thorn, Arrow Mages. Here we go. Get ready for the Arrow Mage package. Titania. This must be the Rikas. I smell it. Yeah. Oh, it's the Rikas. Oh, is this Europrint? It is. It looks dark. Yeah, Europrint's nice. These are nicer than the English ones. Than uh, TCG print. Rose Ballot Revelation. I thought about playing that card, but it's just too slow. Polynosis, no, that card's too slow. But the, my favorite card, Strena, <laughs> in the deck. Teardrops. Perialis. Yes. Oh, um, we got Megalith. Whoa, Megalith Rikas. Hold on. Is this, is this some new tech? No, I'm pretty sure you just. Is took this some new decks? tech? Oh, Manjus. Manjus are money. Yeah. And the whole incantation package is money. Incantations! Yeah, you pretty much any ritual deck, you have to play the incantation package. Because it's just so free. Woo! Put this back in here. Wait, let me put it back in the right way. Bam! Alright. We just. That's like the end of the first box, but. Yeah, if you're like me, you forget that there's a second one. Ooh, the second box. <laughs> Ooh, fusion substitutes. Prank kids. Speaking of prank kids, we were just talking about them. <laughs> you know, prank kids with Thunder Dragon is not a bad idea until Colossus got hit. Hmm. Really, don't think it was a bad idea. <sighs> ooh, ooh, oh, I see maids. Dragon me! Oh shoot, these are secrets. Welcome to the hospitality. <laughs> Chamber. Yay. Lorper. Parlor. Tinkek. Ah, Ooh, the gold rares. The beautiful, the bootyfuls. To be fair, OG kitchens are just expensive. Yeah, obviously. Nurse. Waifu. Waifu for days. I think you only play one. Oh, I didn't even know this coming super. Okay. I was playing the Dragon Link version. With the Ramis. Yeah, I think you can play that version in slot too. Dragon Shrine, Dragon Tails, and then. Madolce. 
This must be the Modoshi deck. Oh, ultimate. Oh my gosh. See what I mean? Isn't this beautiful? Oh my gosh. Isn't this beautiful? Yeah. Woo. I'm not gonna, actually, she has three extra, so I'm gonna put this over here. Cause I wanted to keep the deck cores together, but mm. he had the three extra ones, so. Salons. Salons. Hot cakes. cakes. Pudding sis. Ooh, there's that one. But you, the ultimate one's the best one. Oh no. Ooh, Angelis. Cool. I don't know down below if you think this is worth it so far. What do you think? I just like the ultimates. My dog cheese. Mm. They're nice? Yes. Right. Well, you, you should have been playing Yu Gi Oh about nine years ago when that was a thing. Mm. Return of the Duels was, I think, ten years ago. So. Yeah, I know. What scissors like that? What? What do you mean? <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> oh. Alright, let's see what's in this. Yeah, who holds this like this? No. Guys, I can explain. Judging. What's, <laughs> the, what's the runtime so far on the video? 21. 21 minutes? Yeah. Yikes. Uh, we had to cut the video because it's running a little bit long for my camera, but got all this stuff in there. So, let's see what we got. We got supplies. <laughs> supplies. Oh, wait, these are oversleeves. Oh. Oh, well, th those are the things you were looking for. Yeah. Crack a lack and let's see what they look like. So let's say I want this access code, right? Uh, welcome to another episode of Oversleeve Checking. So we were checked with KMC Character Size Guards. This is probably the most sought after Oversleeve in the market right now. Let's see. So let's say this access code talker, I'm like, oh, this is fire. So here's what you want to do is you want to put your card backwards on the sleeve first. Then over it, you put it over. That way it's protected. You get what I mean? You wouldn't put it on top twice. Yeah, okay, that makes sense. It looks good. Beautiful, right? Mm -hmm. Welcome to Oversleeving. And this has been Oversleeving 2020. Well, I would use the Dark Magician Girl Sleeve. That'd be fire. Well, that's how you oversleeve a card. It's so cool. Guys, get excited. Get excited. <laughs> Alright, next. The Anniversary Sleeves. Hypermat Minis. Dice and um, this is a magnetic dice. That's cool. So <gasps> I love it. I've never seen that before. And then this is a magnetic case, so it just <gasps> that's so cool. Wait, that's it. Cool, right? Yeah. Cool beans. All right. More card barriers. So these are oversleeves, but without the design. Is that the right dimensions? Yeah. Um, so. close to. Uh, more white sleeves. I don't think they're dragon shoes though. That's my favorite brand. More hypermat minis. More of these sleeves. And then some more, yeah, same sleeves. Cool. And we got two binders in here. So let's look at these deck boxes and see what's in there. Oh, there's more decks. Oh, <laughs> I see tangies. Oh. Oh, is that appliance or deck? seen one of those in ages, so Ashuna, Vishuda, Adhara, Sasara, Sh uh, Adhara, Mir Mir, The Vessels, Monk, Lan, Shaman, uh, Rip Denglong, the card's banned. <laughs> Denglong, no! Unchained. Oh uh, boy. Unchained. OG Disasters. Supers, Rares, Malice. Tour guides, abominations, OGs, supply squad. That's actually kind of smart. So you could draw a card every time you destroy a card. Mm -hmm. But it's only once per turn, though. Imagine if it wasn't once per turn. They just keep destroying themselves to draw. <laughs> appliancers, get get your OTKs I with like appliancers. That cutie over there. Or this one, this is the main yeah, one. Yeah, he's a cutie. Wait, do you play with Time Lords? Holy shoot, this is some next gen tech. Didn't think about I didn't think about it like that. Yeah, if you want to build a really cheap budget deck, appliances is just really funny. They're cute. I like them. 
This is like a what did you, what did you lose to at uh, locals? Uh, applying. To? This is really funny. It's like the same thing I did with Dragon Mans when you wreck people with the deck. That like they don't expect to be wrecked, but they're like, what is this? <laughs> home scratch, home, a uh, home scratch, <laughs> home stretch, guys. We got King Yenma, mahogany. If guys, don't get, the, if you guys get the reference. Let me know down below. You didn't get the reference for sure. Mahogany. No. You ever watch Dragon Ball Bridge? No. Oh, oh, watch Wars. Wesh Wars. Alright, this has to be Crusadia. This has to be Crusadia. No, what? Uh, no, Scriptrons. The, uh, the cold deck. <clears throat> like the cold talker deck? I don't yeah, actually even know the official name. I'm just calling it the Cybers deck. Mm. The Clock Wyverns, the Sinet. We saw the Minings earlier, so. That's a cute card. She's a the Cybers, yep. Of course Cybers Wish. She's the waifu. Power code and the access code is obviously down there. AIs. <laughs> Ignisters. This deck has so much potential. They're so cute and weird and round. They're like good going second, but that's about it. It's kind of hard going first with this deck. It's kind of tricky. Um, Lightning Storms does make it a little bit easier, but. Ooh, OG Dark Fluids. Uh, OG Ignisters. Oh, they only come and run. Alright, there's no more deck boxes. It's been, it's been 30 minutes. I've been looking at a lot of cards, so I gotta breathe. <laughs> where do I put the box? Oh, there it is. I'm like, where's the box? Guys, where's the box? Oh, shoot. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, that'll, that'll be last. <laughs> I'm like, oh shoot, man. Binder time. The first one. It's a new monster. I gotta sit down for this because my back's about to break. Beautiful front page. We got the white pages on the inside, so it looks really bougie. Relinquish animars. Is it gonna be multiples? Yeah. Cool. OG Bore Load. Oh, is that a Euro print too? Lambdas. Hippo Shinigan, Maxi, that card's not coming back. Ever. Nanta Shifter. Gammas, your favorite one. Rip. Alice to the Invoker, Secrets. Some girls. Woo, makes you wonder about TG Wonder. Topic feature Rafflesia Secret Baguska Utopia Double and Gears 2 Double. Hey, true name Extra Foolish Burial Hoppies. Oh, well, there's no dust there, but I was just yeah. Zombie World Ultras Pot of Riches, the Forgotten Pot. Honest Fusion, Earth Shadow and Event. This card is extremely good against Virtual This card will make Virtual Wars lose. Single handedly. Pretty good. Living Fossil. Ah, uh, it's the Wind Witches. Wind, wind Witches. And then, um, this card is all banned. <laughs> no. Seeing Glow Bolt makes me so sad every time I see her. I used to play her like every plant deck. What is the other Behind you. Oh, shoot. Oh, this one has a strap on it, so it's gonna be, it's gonna be fire because it's red. <laughs> okay. Evenly match. Oh wait, no, that's not evenly. This goes a match. Anti spells. I hate that card. Mistake. This card is not bad right now. It makes it so your opponent um, can't add cards from the deck to the hand, except by drawing. Mm. Just strike. I like the cute viruses. The wrenchels. Back to the front, back to the back, Solemn Warnings. That's an original one. Wow, I haven't seen an original one in a while. Reincarnations, get out! Other Madote stuff. Compulse. Oh, these are rares, Jesus. Four magical Musketeers. IOC rares, other Prankit stuff. I think this is extras of like the deck cores. Reboot. Bunnies. 
And then this wall radius, the card's pretty good. Pretty gas. Uh, the Tenny stuff, and to top it off, ooh, transmodifies. Ooh, -hoo. last page, bam. Ooh, ooh, <laughs> Sukuyomis. All right, now on to the box of bulk. Uh, supposedly, right? I'll see what's in here. Got some dank magicians. Packet swaps. Target a face up link monster you control, non link, and one link monster your opponent controls, switch control of both of those. Okay. But it says target though. Dirge, oh boy. I've never gone through like um, a stack of cards on this channel before, so this has to be Endemians. That pumpkin over there in the Hello, corner. You mean Hello Hello? Yes, he's cute. Yeah, you never seen Hello Hello? No, but I love him. Oh god, I hate this rarity. It's so bright. Look at this. Oh my god. Nauseatingly bright, right? I've never seen that before. It's got, um. Uh, let's see. <laughs> really bright. Secret. <laughs> Hyper secret? I don't know. It was only for the tins, and like people were like, no, don't do this. Stop doing this. <laughs> we're, not, we're trying to play Yu Gi Oh! and not get a seizure. Ooh, fire formation tankies. Another kind of thing about when you get these collections, like sometimes the small cards just start adding up. Mm -hmm. This must be pack stuff. That's a Dream Mirror card. That guy played a smart. He probably um, bought a lot of singles. That's probably his, that's why his collection is so uh, massive. But like it's very targeted. Like there's not really many like cards that don't fit. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Feliz, Super Poly. Oh, that's a that's definitely a structure deck. I keep forgetting the avarices in the deck. I remember when the deck came out, avarices were like 20 cents. So I bought a whole bunch of avarices. Because I'm like, I never want to buy Potter Avarice ever again. So if you buy so many avarices. I like Pot of Avarice. Pot's pretty good. But at two, though. At three is too much. Too much. Woo! Wait. Woo! I think this card's worth a bit. You almost shot the camera, miss. Yep. Oh no. Apex Avion. Uh, uh. Oh, -hoo. oh. Oh, I miss this card so much. I used to play Pendulums, like, that's the only deck I ever played. But then they hit them so hard, and I'm like, yeah. That's that's actually the reason why I initially quit. Mm -hmm. I was like, oh, I, like, I really like Pendulums. Well, with Dragoonies, I like the two, and then Master Rule 4 happens, so I'm like, oh, I can't even play Dragoonies now. Ooh, Muddy Mud Dragon. That's good. Ooh, Dank Magician stuff. And Demians. These are the OG and Demians before the Pendulum one. Magical Dimensions. Oh cool. Okay, this is gonna be a little bit quicker than I thought it'd be. Yeah, let's go Zephras and Shadal stuff and Zephras. Enlightened Paladin. Yeah, if I miss any cards, which I probably did, like let me know in the comments down below. I probably did. Oh. Oh. Alright, let's go, let's go. Double iris, this card just got limited. Oh shoot, <laughs> shoot, shoot, shoot. I'm going too fast. Gotta go fast. Chitana. Oh, Conquery? Oh, I hate that. Wait. I've never seen RPO2 ones. Try at least uh, 20 cents. Hey. Hey. The Shadow Structure Decks. Yes. Can't get sick of those. The Structure Decks is so good. Spellbook. Oh, Altergeist. I get too sh I get too shook seeing Altergeist. Imperial Order. Oh, I hate that card so much. It's like, yeah, I'm gonna flip it on you and just can't play Yu-Gi-Oh. But like, they had to draw into it, so. Cause I don't, right now I don't believe there's an easy card that searches continuous traps. Cause if that was the case, that'd be broken. Imagine if Trap Trick 
Search continuous traps, that'd be broken. No monster reborn, reborn. <laughs> like how they made the card and then reborn came back. <laughs> and we're like, we all sat there, we're like, okay. And then just you are a mirage transformation. It looks so cool. Then where is? Scissors cross. Because of a cross and scissors. Yeah, get it, get it. I mean, you don't seem to know how to hold scissors, so. I mean, I cut myself opening the pack. Yeah. So. On camera, I don't know if that's allowed. No. Oh, Dmok. Dark Magician of Chaos. We haven't seen one of those in ill time. All that attacks was like the most degenerate OTK card because basically what it does is it makes your opponent attack into your monster. <laughs> when every monster they control, they have to attack. Oh. And you would play this card called Cactus Fighter. You know what Cactus Fighter does? No, but I've heard of it. If that card destroys something by battle, right? Mm -hmm. you, you summon a token onto your opponent's side of the field in attack mode with zero attack and zero defense. So you play this, and then because it's summoned, they have to keep attacking the Cactus Fighter and they lose. <laughs> cool, right? Cool? Mm -hmm. That's, uh, I think I had that happen to me a few years ago, and I was like kind of devastated. By a few years, I mean at least 10 years ago. Magician of Faith. Nice. Alright, there's some more sleeved up cards here, so I'm kind of curious. Let's go bottom of the barrel first. The sleeved up cards has to be the Endymion deck. Super Quantals. White Howling. Bottomless Trap. Oh! Hamster! Oh no, he's cute! You haven't seen a Rushy Hamster before? No, but he's cute! That's cute too. Huh. Woo! Aloof Lupine. Lupine. Oh, this card. Uh. Orcus Nightmare. Grinmaju. Oh, Grinmaju. Hey, look, Crusadia. Oh, Grinmaju. <laughs> oh, oh, uncensored. Nice. Nice, 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 nice. Demok. All right, let's see what's what the non. I'm having trouble here. Let's cut my nails today, so it's a little bit. Okay. Ah, uh, all right. Apprentice. Last but not least. Oh wait, got more. Oh, this car's so banned. <laughs> so banned. This car's actually got so good. Oh, is this the Draco stuff? It's like basic insect, dragon treasure, legendary sword, dragon shield, Tyhone, not Tyrone, Tyhone. Um, monster egg, I think it's actually called monster egg. And this one is vile, vile germs. Yes, they look very vile. And that's enchanting mermaid, I think. Or mermaid enchantress. Into the void! Oh, this is definitely a pendulum deck. Oh, allures. And that, and that completes 1600 dollar collection. Let me know down below if you thought it was worth it. Um, in hindsight, there's a lot of deck cores here, so it's pretty good. Uh, shout out to the guy that, you know, sent me over on Discord and he's like, yo, let's figure out, figure this out. You're a chill guy. Hope you, you and your family had a great time. Really appreciate it, dude. And if anybody else wants to sell me stuff, please let me know or at me on my Discord. My Discord link is in the description and I'll find you there. All right, I'm Akemi TCG. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye guys. The world ends now.